Welcome, Battle Brothers. This is Subhuman bringing you a live action gameplay commentary of Warhammer 40,000 Regicide by Hammerfall. This game is in early access and as such is not complete. I'm going to be uh, experimenting with a tactic that I thought up and we'll see how it goes. We're going to be playing Orc versus Space Marine because I feel Space Marine will be stronger against this tactic because of their uh, high armor or possibly weaker. I may try it with both sides. It's essentially uh, an, a kind of combination of moves that in theory could result in trading a uh, bishop for a bishop and castle and pawn. So that's what I'm going to try and do here. Uh, I'll be playing at veteran master difficulty. Uh, I want to see if the AI can spot this trick and I will be uh, starting myself a new game. So Essentially, the idea is to exploit the uh, shooting phase and the uh, green is best ability in order to um, do a diagonal slide across the board and take out a castle and bishop. So, we start with a relatively common move. We'll move our pawn forward. Um, we'll use an action point us, because um, we want to have some action points available for next turn so we'll just use the one to get him to duck i think we'll also throw a force field on our bishop here i'll come to that in a second switch to the other guy forward to victory grenade okay well probably wasn't the best plan to put shield in last all but i We'll continue with our attempt anyway. Weak. You want us dead? Okay. Move here. Okay, and now the combo is Green is best on him, which should give him plus three. Iron go on him, well, platinum. which should make his attacks critical, and then shoot at this, this fella. one. Mine! And insta kill. Great damage. Um, well, then, switch goes. I seek the enemy. Queen comes out. I do not falter. Engage! Your life force empowers me. Okay, so here's the combo. You is to bring me an ammo down. Let your finger off the trigger. Take the pawn. Cunning gets to break his armor. And an assault move him. 85% chance. Then we stun the hardest hitter, which is going to be probably him. So tell him to stun him. Ah! This should slow him down! And then tell him. I can't tell him to duck. Can't heal him because healing isn't an option anymore. Oi, you! So may as well shoot him. Our victory is assured! So we get the moving attack from him. Stay Hopefully, here for a second. He can survive all three melee attacks. Charge! You oh. will fall. Oh, dead. So that was a trade of a um, bishop and um, pawn for a bishop, and obviously a very broken up king's side. Don't know why the queen's forward, but that just gives us a bunch of extra attacks to throw at the queen, so I may as well do that. I think it would have been better to put the shield on after I'd moved rather than before that grenade. What do you want? Up. 
I'd have survived a lot better without that. So now, I think out, we may boys. as well get up in Time the boys, well, move it out. Because uh, melee attacks do more damage. So I may as well just get up in the Queen's Grill. And. Assault. Easy target! <laughs> Blast them! Shoot. And playing with these guys. Oi, Shoot. you! Eat this! brothers here's the thing well, I suppose that he successfully oh shoot the queen I was going to say let's assume that he successfully um, killed that pawn because he was doing the moving attack but no he we got here him. we go so I'll move this fella up block his uh, attack Get off! I'm trying to shoot here. Down by four hit points, so we can just. Oh, you lovely one! Ha, right. The enemy has few places left to run. Throwing grenade. <laughs> Weapon ready. Okay, so let's see one, two, three, four, and here it's one, two, three, four. Yeah. Um, oh, here, nowhere for him to run. Just the, the way I like it. The queen doesn't appear to be doing anything. This thing's just as dangerous up close. So, well, from here we're a queen and a um, pawn up. We did manage to one-shot the opposing um, bishop. So we're going to try this versus orcs next. I'll just pause this for a bit and we'll reset the board. Okay, Battle Brothers, we're back. And now we're going to be playing orcs versus orcs at Veteran Master. See if we can get the same snipe to work. Um, this time we're going to remember to hang fire on the shield until after we've taken so again oh here but nowhere for him to run just the one. way i like it and you know what we're going to injure that piece now to get that on cooldown because we don't need the action point for everything else we got him now boss I hope I threw the right big at time. I did this time we don't need the shield. Good. <laughs> you want us there? Okay. Take the diagonal. Attack him there. And. Get him plus three, plus three. Find gold. Well, flatten them! Get an extra crit, snapshot. <laughs> and and the turn. Let's get to it. Dagger, dagger, dagger. Here's one more! Okay. Loot is a red shoot! Shoot! Ah, we're flash kids, we are! Look at them run! Now, of course, this is quite a risky move because if you miss this shot, then you're basically totally boned which means you do the assault first oh, how do you get one over in here? Of... Oh. so if you get it though 
He then stun ah, him so he can do the um, Iron Gob, giving all those guys crit. Can't tell him to duck now, so we'll when I hit you, you're and dead. shield him. And we've got a shot left, so as well we'll pop a shot at him. Oi, you! Hey, Tesh! <laughs> we'll make it orky! This is me best chopper! Break the shield. This thing's just as dangerous up close! Can't afford the bonus to work. Easy the target! <laughs> Uh, it looks like using the shield and the orcs bonus to damage um, means that I think for this technique a squig bomb is required. So it looks like um, you can trade a bishop and uh, a bishop for a bishop and pawn, plus a lot of cooldowns on your powers. So while that is a cool looking ability, the fact that the bishop almost certainly dies to the surrounding pieces um, on orcs because orcs combat means that this is not a technique to use with orcs. I think it's against space marines the technique's more likely to work. If I remember to put my shield on, they wouldn't have been able to put enough damage on me to finish me off, I don't think. Um, except if they had saved action points. But even then, we've done an uneven trade. Um, they've got pieces out on the board to shoot. Um, you can play an all game from here. Or we can copy the manoeuvre on the other side of the board. Um, in fact, in this direction, because the bishop's out, potentially you could actually um, just straight up castle snipe rather than uh, bishop snipe. So that might be actually the way to do it. Uh, we're going to try that now on both sides. Instead of shooting at the bishop, we'll shoot at the castle with our bonuses and see if that works, so we're pausing now. Unpausing again, starting ourselves a new game. Won't be no day, I ain't away from us! And this time we're just gonna try directly sniping the castle with this maneuver, see how that does. So, probably wouldn't do that in a game against him because that really telegraphs your intentions. Um, not gonna throw the shield on got two action points to spare so surrounded by one two three four five pieces here one two three four pieces here so we'll wait until after the move to do the next bit we got him now boss stick bomb incoming so they're concentrating far on the queen fair enough not unreasonable. <laughs> Let's get to it! That's going to use his dagger. Now this time, what I think I'll try is moving the queen across before using green is best. So... This is my death gun! Shooting at that pawn. Blast them! And apparently missing wildly. World's luckiest dagger, dagger, dagger. Well, spend all the action you? points to hey, have some extra next turn. Blast them! Not sure if we're trying to do things, but we're going to we'll lose the same person to make a difference. So, before I got plus three, plus three. This one, mine! I'm going to go for plus four, plus four. This should slow him down! So okay. we'll move the across. I'll go this way! That should increase the green is best bonus. It's plus four, plus four. That's still plus three, plus three, so totally not worth doing that. There we go. Take a shot. 
Do have to lie and gold this turn. Break some skulls! Nowhere for him to run, just the way I like it. Okay. Looks like the loss of tempo Oi, there is not worth it because we end up with a pawn in the way. So can't do it that way, can't move the queen across. Pausing again, we're going to restart. Here we go. Okay, restarting again. We got a gate away from us. Got the castle. Let's go. Nowhere for him to run. Just the way I like it. He's trying to block the diagonal. Get ready for the boom! Won't be the okay. he got so him now, we'll do boss. Is we'll go on the other diagonal. This diagonal's blocked. Dagger, dagger, dagger. It's worn for now. Blast him! Kind of thing that the king's pawn opening is more popular than the queen's pawn opening. So. Dagger, dagger, dagger. Probably opening on this diagonal first is a wiser plan, but we'll find out. We've done all the shots we want to for now. We'll save those two. If you say so. Points. It's actually bringing up the other guy now. So I think we'll go back to our original plan. We'll just try and kill off that piece by moving across. Oi, you! Eat this! Blast them! Boss, we got down behind. We go here. Green is best. Plus two, three, three. Take the shot. Hope <laughs> yes. That's bothersome. Well, like Flatnum, which was really bad of me. Um Daga 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 Can we finish off his pawn with our remaining action points? One more skull, come on. Oi, you eat this! Now I don't know if you to the he does. And as usual the enemy hits. Daga Daga Daga! But the important thing is we have the iron god <laughs> and we have the green. We'll <laughs> so I love the sound of more ducka in the morning. Get up. And we're gonna find out if we're able to one shot that castle. Or at least damaging enough that it's worth it. Get any closer, okay. and I'll bite your face off! Did we kill him? No. Significantly reduced his health. That guy's now going to die, so... Can't throw a grenade far enough to finish off that orc. That will cause him to spend a lot of resources, but... Again, doesn't look like it's worth it against orcs. If we kill the bishop, we lose our guy pretty much immediately. There's four guys in there. We can only stop three melees. We could try using a stun in there, a squig bomb, but then we'd have to give up either the heal or the custom force field, and that totally doesn't seem worth it. So we're going to try against space rings now. Pause it again. Okay, here we are trying again. Our diagonal attack against the space rings. So. Because the king's pawn forward is more popular, we're gonna point us to the boys. Move it out. Go from this side. Telegraph our intentions somewhat. And next turn. Tactical movement. Oh, does go forward. I think we're gonna. Grenade. Try and kill off that. We, we are the 
shootiest. If we can kill the pawn in one turn. And this is. Right, yeah. some stars. So we've now got plus lots to hit and this one plus damage. Mine. Seventy-five percent. That's it. Kills. Got two points spare, so I think at this point we'll just save those. Advancing into battle. Two. Queen comes up. Tempted Wait to get in the Queen's grill. Striking, I grow stronger. But now the Queen's life leeched, I'm almost certain I'm not going to be able to one-shot the Queen. So I will Death try guns. and <laughs> fight. We're flash dicks we are! Look at them run! And we will now solve oh, this guy. How do you get over here? Okay. We will stun. The guy can do When I turn. hit you, you're dead! And then we'll throw the shield. Stay out. there for a second! See how that works? I seek the enemy. Basically, end up getting surrounded. But, base rings don't get the additional ground damage. Assaulting with a thing first was a bad idea. You shall fall! Because the queen probably does the most damage of those units, so... Take that! Basically wasted a time. Well, uh, reasonable Charge. chance of surviving. If Okay, we missed. Good. So now we got to let your feet shoot, shoot. Yeah! And now we get to do some more damage to their stop marine. Okay, so uh, that seemed to go pretty well. We've cleaned out a lot of their back row. We'll probably lose this guy, but he's really done his job. We can throw the healing on him and so on. So uh, now I'm going to try and see how this works with Squig Bomb as well. So pausing again. So we've seen the Space Marine uh, versus Space Marine tactic um, castle snipe there. Seems to work quite nicely. It's relatively easy to kill off the bishop in hand to hand. Orcs having the stronger hand to hand damage, we're going to see if the squig bomb works. I'm not sure if it's better to swap out the squig bomb for the healing or the shield. What do you want to for him to run? Just so the way I like it. It appears for some reason Queen's Pawn forward seems to happen a little bit more versus the AI, so we're just going to go from this side, see if we get lucky. Dang, yeah, I can't go away from us! Because I'm an idiot. I hope I threw the right bit that time. Looters are just a few here. more shots from me, death gun, and this will all be over. We telegraph on tension. We, I think, we'll try killing the looter. So. Um, we do do the panels here. We do do the. Well, um, Platinum! We take one shot against <laughs> him, which misses, because. <laughs> that may even be an insta gip. No, okay. We save the last action point because we have to stun next turn. We are the shootiest! This 
This is my death count. Okay. You is gonna let okay. your figure. We're flash kids, we are. Look at them run. Get any closer, and I'll bite your face off! Yes. Which basically means we lose. Stun. I'm gonna stun the last one. When I hit you, you're ah, dead! Ah, 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 slow with a flash! Get me off! So that shows the disadvantages of this cheesy tactic. We're going to throw a restarting. <laughs> Let's try the same again this time, not forget to waste Why the not, point. We got him now, boss. Hey, I ain't no away from us. At the least, this is a way to farm XP against the AI. Stick bomb! Incoming! Death gun! Boss! We got down behind! So, things to not forget. Iron Gob. Hope you boys, he's ready for fighting! You. This is my death gun! And... Got the spare action points. So Oi, I'm you! Eat this! No! Run. Clears the board nicely. There we go, saving one action point. Let's get gun. to it! This one, mine! <laughs> oh, I love her! We're flash kids, we are! Look at them run! Off. Try the squig bomb. Try and catch all the beast guys. Catch the main guys. Um, you can then use him. Stay there for a second. Nowhere for him to run. Just the way I like it. He though moves out of the way. I'm trying to shoot again. Opening assaults from all the other pieces, so. <laughs> Bottom line is, this isn't good against orcs. Um, essentially, your chances of surviving long enough to the, take the castle don't appear high enough, even if you get a good stun off. Um, so, yeah, this uh, snipe across the board is only good um, versus Space Marine, where they don't get the bonus hand-to-hand -hand damage, which really is devastating against orcs. Um, I could have saved a point for a shield, so I will try that and see if that changes things. So uh, let's try this again. Restart. Won't be long. We got him now, boss. Move up. Shift. So. Here we go. Oh, 
I hope I threw the right brig that time. <laughs> Just a few more shots from me, Death Gun, and this will all be over. So, what to do? Plus three, plus three. Well, Platinum! Get the crits. This one, mine! Save the two action points. Boys, move it out! Blast them! Oi, you! Eat this! Right. We got to go! Right. Let your feet bring me an ammo crot so I can keep firing! So we have all five of our action points. So the first thing we'll try is killing him. Zorgo! chance. Finish him. Now we throw our stun. Get everyone. So I'll tell him to stun. Who else is in line of sight? Can't stun these two. Didn't expect the stun to hit everyone. So we'll assume I spent one point. Stunning one of these two guys, definitely him, so he can't iron gob as a primary stun, depending on which stuns didn't go off. And we'll throw the shield. So the last action point would have been telling him to stun somebody. Um, I don't think there's anybody here who there's a point in him stunning, but I'll just stay there for a sec. We're there. gonna keep him on the run. So, Tiger Hugger down, to... right? Dagger, dagger, dagger. Then the castle. Won't Loot is already bought. Bring me away. Oh, oh, you you get it down to more Dagger in the morning. So that essentially worked. Okay. Get any closer, and I'll bite your face off! because every time your pieces get injured, you can't heal them. Now, you can only heal fairly rarely, so I don't know how huge a swing that's going to be, but it does mean things like you have to be a lot more careful with your queen, you can't buff up a weakened piece, but obviously I've gained significant advantage here. This strategy will work better against um, enemy AI than humans, because humans will cock cotton onto this pretty quickly, uh, I mean, a very simple way to stop it is just move this port here, forward one, uh, to block the diagonal, and that's the job done. Basically, you can't get the snipe off anymore, because um, it's the fact that he's attacking Canton combat and gets the two damage from there uh, allows it to be an instant kill on the uh, bishop as long as it's been weakened by the knife. So, um, the shield is, I believe essential for it to work against orcs so it can potentially work against orcs it's a good start against an enemy ai um but i don't think it's practical against uh orc player uh, i think it's a lot better strategy against space marines where uh, once their armor cracks they're really squishy and they don't have that hand to hand bonus which is uh pretty much vital so um, yeah, this has been Subhuman bringing you a uh, quick uh, castle sniping guide. Mainly works space against space marines, can be made to get to work against orcs, but um, 
again, this is a very cheesy tactic. It's for grinding experience rather than for actually winning games. I think that the amount you have to invest in this move for it to go off is pretty high, but you still get to use a pretty cool combo, and if somebody hasn't seen it, it's quite fun. Uh, this has been Simon Hugh Brown bringing you a live-action commentary of 140,000 Regicide. Peace out. <laughs>